The pectoralis major muscle, its origin, insertion, and actions. The pectoralis major is the most superior and largest muscle of the anterior chest wall. It is commonly divided into three independent segments, the clavicular part, the sternopart, and the coastal part. We can see that the clavicular head originates, proximal attachment, from the anterior surface of the medial half of the clavicle. The sternal head originates from the anterior surface of the sternum and the first seven coastal cartilages. The coastal head originates from the cartilage of the sixth rib and the aponeurosis of the external oblique. The muscle fibers from all three parts run laterally and converge into a broad tendon that inserts distal attachment into the lateral lip of the intertubercular sulcus of the humerus. The innervation of the pectoralis major comes from the lateral pectoral nerves and medial pectoral nerves. Lateral and medial pectoral nerves, C5 to T1. The actions of the pectoralis major are shoulder horizontal adduction, shoulder internal rotation, and shoulder adduction, mainly by the sternocostal head. The clavicular head can create flexion when the shoulder is in an extended position. The sternocostal head can extend the shoulder when it is flexed. The pectoralis major is also an accessory muscle of inspiration acting to expand the rib cage during forced inspiration. The muscle pulls the rib cage anteriorly, therefore lifting the ribs and expanding the thoracic anterior posterior diameter. To strengthen the pectoralis major, use exercises such as push-ups, chest presses, and dips. To stretch the pectoralis major, hold your arms in horizontal abduction.